video again. Uh, since we left, we we have done a bit of turnover and stir the the potatoes. Now we are going to tip the coriander, nicely evenly balanced coriander there, and we will top the chopped up finely chopped up onion. There we go, and we will go we'll. We'll mix them up together again. We'll mix them nice and evenly again. So the ingredients all well mixed. And you have to you have to keep on mixing it. Unless you mix it, you, you have to keep, keep gently simmer it for another couple of minutes. The whole procedure should take you about 20 minutes. Look at the nicely brownish color there. Uh, as you can see, it's still simmering away. And normally, make sure you will have a get low, lower setting on your gas marks because you don't want to burn while you're cooking. So, just make sure you have it on a lower gas setting. As you can see, our alu bhaji stir fry potato is almost ready. We'll show you, we'll put it on a dish in a minute, so just a few more minutes. Obviously you can, uh, in relation to hot chili, you, you can use chopped up green chilies. If you like green chilies, you can put green chili. Uh, if you like very hot, you can... Put, uh, according to your need, you know, the, uh, the chili powder. Or if you don't have coriander, you can put some parsley. That will give you an even greater flavor. There we are. There we go. It's, and it's, um, we give a final mix up. There we go. We we will here. We are. You have your. We have our alu bhaji. It's best to serve with plain rice. If you eat in it, eat this with plain rice. It'll be very excellently taste. It's fantastic. It goes well with plain rice. Normally we eat it with plain rice. There we go, a quick, easy recipe. There we go. It's, um, this is a quite favorite recipe in Bangladesh. And we just showed you how to make it now. So, thank you for watching the video.